Hey y'all, welcome back. I got a quick Hobby Lobby haul. I know, I'm so over Hobby Lobby. But, I went there Monday because I went there. <laughs> and then today I went back because I was stuck in traffic and I needed to stall some time. So I pulled over at the one on um, Preston Road in Dallas. And I um, got, you'll see, I'll show you. Okay, so the other day when I went, I got these. And I got the one thing here. I'll show you. I got this. I got my little, I know, I said I wasn't getting another rooster. But he's white, off whitish, And he's going to go very good in the other, you know, living room area. Because every time I put a colorful rooster over there, I was like, I don't like it. You know, it was just good. Now, it wasn't working. But now that, um... This one will work on my tall shelf there. And it was eleven ninety nine, so it was four dollars. Nope, three dollars. It was three dollars. Three, six, nine, twelve. Yes. Three dollars. Seventy five percent off. Come on now, y'all. Three dollars. Had to get him. Had to bring old buddy home. Okay, then you remember the last last week or the week before, I had got these copper napkin rings. So they're now on sale for 75% off and three, they're a dollar a piece, right? So I was like, why don't I get four more and throw them in my giveaway box? Yes. So I got four more of these copper um, napkin rings. So they're, they're going in the giveaway box. And then I got, I didn't get a lot of, like you'll see, I did not. I really didn't. I just got some important stuff. This was $2.99, and I do have a mason jar that I keep my, um, that I told y'all I use the raw sugar for, just for coffee. I don't really use it for anything else, but I thought this was cute, more, had a little more style to it, and it was $2.99, so I got it. Yes, it is the, sort of the same thing, but not exactly. It's not a basic mason jar. So, it says sugar on there, and I thought it was cute for $2.99. Whatever. That's what I got Monday, right? Oh, and I got one more thing. Wait a minute. Y'all gonna have to relax. That's what you're gonna have to do. Things. <laughs> I have to talk to them. So they won't act crazy on me. Okay. Then I got this. Oh. This is the back of it. Wait. Let me turn it. I said, oh, you know what? I'm looking for something to go over my bed. Right? Because I wanted to change out what I had over my bed. So I was like, you know what? I could get this. But to me, I started thinking, I was like, mm, that's a little too small. I don't know. You know, this was Monday. So this went from $89.99, yes, to $22.49. Not bad. Was it 89 Yeah, $89. So $90 to $22.49. Not bad. Look at that. You see the... um galvanized metal and the round thing and then it has the little flowery thing here i'm actually I'd, so anyway i said that might be too small because uh, my queen size bed a queen size bed um i think mine's 66 inches with the headboard and the footboard and that's only like 30 inches or something like that 32 inches so i was like that would just look dwarfed and I, so i would need something so then I go in today and I'm going to look, I was looking, I was like, I don't know, maybe I could find something else or whatever. So I found these. One second, y'all. These things are dangerous. I found these. And I thought, oh, I'll flank them. Now, that has nothing to do with my bedroom. Right, but I would flank them on the side of that, right? Because because these were nineteen ninety nine. Look at that, galvanized, but they came to five dollars a piece. So I was like, for ten ten more dollars, like I have the back of the thing. But then I was like, huh, I don't know. So I'm still walking around because I'm killing time, and I have these in the shopping cart. And then I saw what I saw. One second, y'all. Look at that. 
I hope y'all can see that. Can you see this? Do you remember my bedding is the peach and then I got the uh, marbly pieces like pillows and the throw and all of that? And I did find the curtain. So actually my curtains are hanging. I got all that up. But um, I've been waiting to do a collab with this company on sheets. They were supposed to be getting me these sheets. The guy keeps playing games. Then when he comes back to answer me again, he sends the same email. Like, you know, I, I'm not going to deal with them. I think I'm going to do this bed, my bedroom, either tomorrow or the, or the following day. I'm going to do that tour in there. Because wa I've been waiting for them to get the sheets so I can, you know, do the collab. Hot mess. But look at that, y'all. It matches. And I know. You're like, okay, well, y'all, that's, that's small, too. It's 24 inches. Found two. I got two. This one was, so I'm going to have two of them. You know, in the room. This one was, uh, I mean, over the bed. One on each side, because there's like, um, you know, I'll, I'll, how I'll measure it out is I'll measure it out like 33 inches on each side, and then I'll center them in each 30 inch, uh, 33 inches. Y'all know what I'm talking about. But anyway, um, this was, this up here. It was $29.99, right? Oh, no, $39.99. So they came to $10 a piece. I got two of them. Now, I wound up still getting those galvanized ones because um, I thought, you know what, maybe I can use them outside or maybe one day I might or in the guest room, I can put this round one in there with the two on the side and kind of play off of, of the galvanized in there. I don't know, but for $5 a piece, that was like 10 to add to the thing that I had already brought that I, you know, I just said, you know what, it's, it was okay. I got it. So look, look at that. Yes, and this is the top here. So this is how it would go. And I got another one. I could not believe. Y'all remember the pillows that match this and the throw that matches this? And then my comforter is just all uh, um, peachy, like a peachy blush. They're calling it blush. But to me, it has like a peachy hue, but it's called blush. So the comforter, um, some of the other pillows, they're that blush. And then I got the decorative pillows that I purchased look like this, this marble effect. The throw has that same marbled effect. Yes, y'all. I was like, yes. Ten bucks, y'all. Regularly 39. So, yeah, I got those. Somebody left a comment. I didn't get a chance to answer it yet. And said, who was it that said, I didn't know people from Jersey say y'all. <laughs> Girl, everybody says y'all. Y'all don't belong to nobody. I've been saying, well, you know what? My father's family, uh, his uh, father and his mother, they were like from South Carolina and Kentucky area. And my father has a very strong country draw. So I, I, a lot of us, you know, the kids, we ha I have, it was five of us. We pick up from your parents. And I, I've never been the type of person to say, like they say commonly, people from Jersey say use. Like if it's two people and you're talking to two people, use, you know, I've never said that. I've never said that. I say, y'all, hey, y'all, come here. Come on. Come on, y'all, let's go. I've always said that. So I don't know. Like, if I stole it from somewhere, but I've said it since I can remember talking. So, I don't know. And my parents said it. So, okay. These were $3.99. And everything, guys, everything that is spring now, springtime and spring shop is 75% off at Hobby Lobby. So, run, get you some. These were a dollar a piece. I got three. And I have, a, um, I don't know if y'all remember, last year on clearance, I got the thing that hold, I said I was going to use for forks and stuff. I was using it. Then I decided I would put those little herb things in it, but I don't really like that. I'm just going to put these three topiaries on it and look like I got topiary balls on them on them uh, galvanized pots with the little rooster. Yeah, so I didn't think that was a bad deal. Look at this. Look at him. Reggie said he is not playing. He said, you better get that thing out of my face. Um, Yeah, like I said, this was $3.00. Three dollars. Go get y'all some. And you know that's gonna be going. Um, this will be a dollar and twenty cent when they finally get the ninety percent. However, you may not see them. But yes, they have it all on clearance. Now I wanted to show y'all. I got um a couple thrift items, and um I'm not gonna do that thrift haul today. I actually have to go back and pick up this tall stand I brought uh, today. I have to go back tomorrow. My car was full. Um, from Peace Bridge. I went to the other Peace Bridge in Frisco. And I also, Monday from Peace Bridge, had bought this um, plant stand. And y'all will see it. I will show y'all that in the thrift haul. 
Um, so I'm not doing a thrift part of it. I only got a few things this week, but I'm going to do it as a thrift haul tomorrow. But I did get these from these couple pieces from, um, Thrift World Dallas. You know, there's only one Thrift World left now. Um, and I got them and I was like, you know what? I can't keep one part. Not this part I could have kept from y'all because I did get jewelry from Peace Bridge separate with not in bags. I got a couple pieces, I even think, from Thrift Giant that wasn't in the bags. And then I got two bags from Thrift Giant. So, um, I'm going to show y'all all of that in my thrift haul. But this, I just couldn't keep the other piece. So, I just brought the bag in. Look at that. Right? Ain't that cute? This is sterling silver. All the uh, silver pieces in here are sterling silver. The clasp is sterling silver. And then, this is some type of carved wood. You see that? Can y'all see that? Like you want to answer me. Some type of carved wood. And I want to say that this is amber on here. I'm not sure though. So I have to, I'm going to test it out and see. But I want to say that that's amber. I really, really, really do. And I haven't really had a chance to look at it. But I think it's amber. This is all amber. And then this is a piece of wood. Because I don't think this is amber. No, I don't. It feels like wood. And then you get the, the amber and the silver down here. So I thought that was so cute. And I got this for blue tags was blue and salmon was 50% off. That's the only sale they had. So I got this for 75 cents. It was $149 and I got it for 75 cents. So I'm gonna check this and make sure it's um to see if it is amber. I'm not sure. I gotta, you know, do some little looking into it better. I just snatched it up because it was set. It's worth the risk at 75 cents. Then this I opened in the car. And, it, well, it was already open. I mean, it wasn't like it was in a bag. It was just stapled up and rolled up. And see, it was $6.99. I'll show you. Green wasn't on sale. I was taking a chance with this because my spidey senses got to tingling and was like, girl, get that thing. Look, this was, they got the worst handwriting. And when you see it backwards, you just look like scribble. $6.99, right? Green wasn't on sale, but it was this. And it was just a whole bunch of junk, right? So, but it was it was folded like this, and folded and stapled, and you couldn't tell what it was, right? So I got in the car and I, I popped them staples off. <laughs> I did. Because I, I knew I was taking a risk. So it, I got, let me see, three, hold up y'all, four, Five. Uh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? In my lap. Sweet. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. I thought it was twelve. I, it might be twelve. I thought I counted twelve. Earlier. But I'll show you. Let me see. We have. Oh, it was. That was just hooked onto something. That yeah, is twelve. Okay, look at this, y'all. Look at the rocking horse. The rocking horse, right? And I know it's probably hard to see on here. On my little iPhone. But this is Sterling Silver. The little rocking horse. And then we have the gingerbread. And they have this little mark. I gotta find out what the mark is. I don't know. It's one I've never seen. It's like a, um, you know, a um, hallmark. I got to see what it is. It's almost like a flower or like four pieces for like, I don't know. I'm going to look it up. I'm going to really do some research on it later. I didn't have time, but this is the gingerbread man. He's sterling. The, and all of them either say sterling or 925. And then, um, this is, oh, an angel. Standing on a cloud with her little wings. I'm trying to get these nails off, y'all, so just ignore my hands. Can y'all see that? Yeah. She's look like she's in a praying position. Little angel there. And then we have an ice cream cone here. See the top of it? The little ice cream cone. <laughs> and then here's the bottom part. Ice cream cone. All of it, every one of them is marked, too. Okay, this one is a duck. 
the oh the um the little hook on here was stuck by. There's a little ducky. I hope y'all can see that. Little duck. And then we have a pup. And he appears to be a Dalmatian because he has little spots all over him. A, not a, did I say that? A dog. See a little puppy? Yeah. Little dog. And then we have uh, another little rocking horse. Di a little different than the first one. The first one has a very wide bottom. Fir first one is way bigger. See? That's the first one. Way bigger. And then we have a fairy flying around <laughs> with her white wings open. See the little fairy? Cute. And then we have the snowman. Little snowman. And then we have I know all of this y'all was $6.99. Something told something and I kept saying, I'm not buying that. And then I said, um, something was telling me, come on, girl, this is a cuckoo clock. Something was like, just get it. Cuckoo clock. Look at the even the little dangling thing, dangling things that the cuckoo clock has. A whole cuckoo clock, y'all. And a sterling silver charm. Ain't that something? Okay, then this one is... What is that? Oh, a teddy bear. A little teddy bear. He's tiny. A little teddy bear right there. I know this lighting ain't the best for y'all. I just wanted to get this done. It's, it looks like it's giving her Annie M. I'm going to be calling Annie M in a few minutes. It looked like the Wizard of Oz out there. Okay, and this one is, oh, Rudolph for one of them. You know, one of the flying reindeers for Santa. See? Yep. So, yeah, that's what I got, and that's what I couldn't hold back. Now, I did get more jewelry. It's out, um, even separate pieces. It's out in the car, but I couldn't hold that back. I had to show y'all. Those charms, I was tickled to death. Because I just thought, oh my goodness. Now, you know how many charm bracelets I have? And to get these put on the charm bracelet, that would be nice. Or, even if I wanted to sell them and sell them separate, that would still be nice, you know. I can make my $6.99 plus a, a nice little chunk more selling them separate, you know. So, um, yeah, because it's 12 of them. So, even, yeah, that would, wouldn't be bad selling them separate. If I was to sell them. Now, I ain't saying I'm selling them yet. I'm not. Because I got a couple charm bracelets that I thought, oh, they would look nice on a charm bracelet. But, you know, who knows. Okay, so I am going to get off here because I might have to uh, fiddle around with trying to get this uploaded walking the streets again before the rain comes. So I'm going to get off here. I will talk to you guys soon. I'm going to get the bedroom um, tour done and in here done. Um, but I was waiting on that. The people, they're just playing games. They're just really playing games. So I got a bunch of stuff over there I'm organizing. That's why I haven't done in here yet. Um, to take down to the, either take down to the um, booth or take to the garage. Then I had an idea. I got all these clothes and I don't wear them. So if I clear out my guest room closet, I can put shelves in there and actually store some of my current stuff that I'm using. See, always storage ideas. So I'm thinking that might be a little transfer. So, I don't need those clothes in there. I haven't even looked in that closet in about nine months. So, why? Why do I have them, right? I could be using that space. And it's a walk-in closet, too. So, you know. Okay, guys. I'm going to get off here and uh, fix something to eat. And I will talk to you guys later. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.